We're reliving classic State League basketball moments. Brownie, where are we today? Well, Dale, to the naked eye, this may seem like just your regular reg residential area, but in fact, many people believe this is the cornerstone of South Australian basketball, Apollo Stadium. Well, this is what's left of it anyway, uh, residential housing now. Uh, but this very ground was once where mighty things happened, including the 1990 Forestville versus South Grand Final. How could we forget? Daryl Pearce, absolutely on fire for the Eagles. 50 points, including 11 three-pointers. Hard to forget it. Let's go see what the uh, lovely people of Richmond remember about that wonderful night. We're here with another resident of this uh, great, great place, Mr. Les Dixon. Les must Nixon. feel... Nixon. Les Nixon. Must feel pretty special to live on the hallowed turf where Apollo Stadium used to be. Well, I didn't know it was the Apollo Stadium. <laughs> I'm new to the state. Oh, okay. But everybody else knows the, the Apollo Stadium. Yep. yep, it was a pretty special place, the home it of was. basketball in so SA. I understand, yes. Do you, have, you, have you heard the, the residents and your neighbours, have they told you much about the 1990 Grand Final? No. Forestville versus South? They probably, I think, I think they, they talk about it quite a bit around here, Forestville versus South. Um, Daryl Pierce, a great basketballer, scored 50 points, hit 11 three-pointers. Probably might have been, you know, the three-point line might have just come through here, so it's some of the ground he would have shot some of those threes on. Must have a practice out here just uh, pretending to be the great man. Who? Daryl Pierce. Daryl Pierce. Do you want me to practice? Oh, do you, if you want to do a little <laughs> shot there. <laughs> for us. That's too hot. <laughs> well, we're here with uh, one of the uh, local local residents of Richmond. We're here with uh, young Keith asking him a couple of questions about that famous night. So, Keith, can you remember much? Daryl Pierce, 50 points. Were you there oh, on that oh. night? Oh, okay, I can picture it. Uh, now. Yeah, 52 points, 11 three-pointers. Did you think he was going to keep scoring like he did? Oh, yeah. yeah. Of course he did, Keith. Of course yeah. he did. <laughs> Whereabouts were you sitting on the night? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. right, we're here with Rudy now. He's doing a bit of maintenance work here in the Apollo district. Rudy, is it a bit of an honour to be working on the very ground where some of the basketball greats went yeah, to work? I, to, I was brought up in this area, yeah, so yeah. Oh, you have many memories from the great well, Many fond memories, yeah. Let me uh, jog your memory. 1990, it's around September. Forest Hill versus South, the State League Grand Final. What do you remember? 1990, I wasn't here actually. All oh, right. <laughs> you would have heard. I was in the surely, UK in 1990. Surely, surely yeah. you've heard whispers around the yeah, Apollo did, district. Yeah, I did hear a bit about it. Yeah. Yeah. Daryl Pierce. Yeah, Daryl Pierce, yeah. 50 points. Yeah. Yeah, 11 three points. Good old days they were. Yeah, oh. yeah. Do you remember, have you heard much about how, you know, how that night went? No, not really. Like I said, I was gone for seven years. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So unless people tell me, yeah, I probably wouldn't know anything. <laughs> yeah. it's good old days though, yeah. It's a special time in a, a special area. This this very floor is... There's uh, two areas that I hold dear. This one here and then with our Rolly Park. Rolly Park? Oh, I don't even know what you're talking about. I'm trying to jog my memory. There's another one whose area used to be where they used to do all the car racing, you know. 